Hello friends of the internet, welcome back to the Driven Dave YouTube channel. If you're just joining us for the first time, hit that subscribe button. Uh, for those of you returning viewers, welcome back. I'm delighted to see you here. Uh, today, we are going to do a little bit of a real world test. Um, as you can see, we are in my, uh, my 2022 Model 3 Tesla, and uh, I have 40, how many miles? I should have looked before I hit record, sorry about that. Uh, 40,872 miles. Um, I had the car for almost, almost a year, not quite. And uh, so, you know, one of the questions that, that a lot of people have, I mean, especially like EV first timers, people that don't know a whole lot about Teslas or EVs is like, hey, what's the range? How far can you go? And those of you that have EVs, you know the answer to that. You don't know. <laughs> it's hard to say. Depends on a lot of things, driving conditions, state of charge, temperature, uphill, downhill, um, and the list goes on and on. Um, so, and really after driving this car almost 41,000 miles, I don't even know how far it goes. I mean, truthfully, I've never tried doing like a hundred to zero. Uh, I would love to do that video, although we're not doing that today. Um, I have to work today, like my other job as a, as a musician. <laughs> so, um, so I just kind of wanted to do like a little bit of a, um, like an update battery. I, I don't want to call it a battery health test because it's not that. Um, I would like to do that procedure and I need to do it soon, just out of curiosity, but it takes like 24 hours, so I can't can't do that today, but I'm at 100% state of charge. I'm gonna flip the camera around so you can see what I'm looking at. All right, here we go. So as you can see, 100% state of charge. I'm gonna, oops. It is showing 337 miles, and that was probably 338 before I left my house. Um, you know, but whatever. So that's what the car thinks it can do. I don't know if that's close to reality or far off. Um, and I'm not really even here to speculate about it. I just want to see kind of what kind of performance a hundred percent state of charge gives us today. So it's a bit of a funny day. I have to drive to Arcadia dropping off an instrument with a friend of mine and uh so that's gonna be 20 18 yeah 18 miles and uh luckily like it's like right off the freeway so that that should be pretty easy and then after that i have to drive to carlsbad <laughs> which is like another 120 miles you know just to get there and then obviously the return trip so it's going to be interesting. We're going to be putting quite a few miles on the car today and, and definitely putting the pack through its paces. Um, I am not anticipating needing to supercharge until the return trip. And I'm just going to let, let the, the bleep bloop thing do its thing and tell me where I need to stop. Those of you that have Tesla's, you know that, uh, road tripping in these pretty easy, pretty trouble free. Uh, the only challenge for me is that like I finished with my job at 1030. So like realistically, I'm looking at being on the road at about 11 PM, uh, which means I'll be home at 12 or one. And then I'm going to have to turn around and leave for work again at 515. So it's, it's going to be a very exciting 24 hours for me. Um, exciting in the fact that I'm going to be very tired. <laughs> so that's cool. Um, but yeah, you know, we're going to see what happens. Um, I have some friends that like to tease me about my videos like this. So this is for you. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so we'll see what happens. Like I said, 336 predicted. Um, you know what? I'm going to reset my Vegas trip. Reset Vegas. And we'll just call this um, Carlsbad. 
Now we'll just call it Carl. <laughs> no. No, we'll call it... <laughs> I'm sorry that I'm ju I just entertain myself sometimes. I can't help it. It's like, I don't even care if you like it. <laughs> Carl's bad. No, oh, I don't want a Z in there. This is in 1995. There we go. Carl's Carl is bad. Yeah. yeah. So we'll see what happens. Uh, we're going to call that, you know, one mile. I mean, I've, I've gone f four miles. Yeah, whatever. It's close enough. Close enough for jazz. So we'll get down to Carl's bad and uh, see where we're at. I may, I may tap in in the middle just to kind of check in um, and give a state of charge update. But eh, I don't really care. We're at 99%. 335 miles so and I'm gonna put the hammer down and see what see what she does all right check in soon hey checking in interesting turn of events sorry I'm going like straight up a hill with these like huge turns interesting turn of events traffic is monumental like like, you wouldn't believe how bad it is. Of course, this is Labor Day weekend, so I guess everyone is going to Carlsbad, <laughs> or San Diego, or Mexico. I don't know where everyone is headed to, but it's wild out here, y'all. So, uh, I needed to stop. I guess I drank a lot of water this morning. <laughs> Don't want to be too graphic, but I just, I needed to, needed to stop. So I stopped in San Clemente and uh, there's a nice Chick-fil-A right off the freeway there. I'm sure a lot of you uh, know that one. And I actually, I really wanted a chicken sandwich, but the line was just way too long. And I, you know, I, I hate to say that I used their facilities and did not patronize their business. I just didn't have time. I totally would have. If they weren't so busy because I love a good Chick-fil-A sandwich man those are great a uh, little slice of cheese on there mm, a little pickle it's just great um, but in any case I accidentally like missed my entrance to the freeway getting out of there which was kind of fortuitous because this is a really pretty drive uh, I don't know where the heck I am but I'm up in the hills of San Clemente I assume and uh, the freeway is backed up so badly that the the map software just routed me through this awesome neighborhood. So, as you can see, so the I've got 33 miles to get to my gig, and it's going to take an hour and 41 minutes. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> no! I mean, it's really driving me. I'm I'm over it, y'all. Look at that. It's all fog. It's crazy. Uh, but yeah, I'm not, I'm not impressed <laughs> with, with how this drive is turning out. Uh, very impressed with the Tesla. It's, it's performing beautifully. Uh, basic autopilot has been really fabulous and the efficiency has been great. Uh, I'm at 72% state of charge, 242 miles estimated range remaining. And that's, uh, 93 miles since I left home. So, you know, we already drove to Arcadia and then uh, most of the way to Carlsbad. I mean, it, how is that possible? <laughs> I don't mean to complain to y'all. It's not, it's not your fault. Uh, this is just nuts. But, you know, I try and find the, the silver lining. Um, and I forgot to charge my iPad last night. So now I'm charging my iPad. You know, there's plenty of time for that to juice up. Uh, so that that's a positive, right? And I get to see this really pretty neighborhood. And uh, and I get to, to do some like regen braking on this hill. See, that's that's also good. We're, we're finding the positives here. We're, but, you know, it's good. I'd be even more positive if I could have grabbed a chicken chicken Sammy at uh, Chick-fil-A, but that's all right. We'll hit it next time. And uh, 
I'm recommending to all my viewers, hit up that Chick-fil-A. It's a good spot. Um, wow. Yeah, this is really pretty. Again, I have no idea where I am, but it looks like I'm going to be entering the freeway again. And there's the ocean out there, which you can kind of see through the fog. Really pretty. These are some nice homes. Maybe like, uh, I don't know. Y you think maybe, you know, 250,000 might, might get you into one of these? <laughs> I suppose if you put a million in front of that, then, then maybe you could get a small one. I can't imagine what these cost. You know, a view of the ocean in San Clemente. Yeah. In a nice neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> probably not not so many trumpet players live here I'm just guessing um, maybe some retired lawyers that play trumpet live here <laughs> they can afford the nice horns um, and the Model S you know speaking of which there's a Model X you know this is not it's not Model 3 territory this is S and X um, okay well uh, I wish I had more of an update, but I think that's uh, I think that's all I can all I can tell you for the moment. I'm gonna get down to uh, get down to my job, or I may check in at my next bathroom stop if this arrival time keeps creeping up. Uh, this is just ridiculous. Um, but yeah, that's that's it. So I will see you in a bit. Okay. Here we are, it is now 2.26, and it took forever to get here. I'm really shocked at like, kind of the efficiency. Um, it's been 123 miles since I charged, and uh, 214 miles of remaining estimated range. 63%. Uh, I'm not going to film all the way into to where I'm working just because I need to figure out where I'm going. Uh, but traffic just opened up like three minutes ago. This has been insane. So really happy to be finishing this drive, or at least this portion of it. Need to find another bathroom. And uh, I wish there was a Chick-fil-A right here. I'd have a finally get my chicken sandwich. Now I want one. <laughs> Can't stop thinking about it. Um, but yeah, so there you have it. Only three and a half hours to drive 125 miles. No big deal. <laughs> um, but, you know, hey, it could have been a lot worse, at least, you know, no accidents and, you know, it, it's fine. There are people having worse days than me. I don't mean to complain. It was just a long drive. But autopilot was great. And uh, listened to some good music. And, you know, can't complain about any of that. Okay, well, I'm going to go to work. And I will check in on the way home. We may not even need to charge, you know, at 63%. Probably at this point, um, uh, probably enough to get home, I would think. But... You know, I'll have to play that by ear. Um, you know, because we didn't really do highway speeds for the last however many miles that was. I mean, pretty much since like Irvine, uh, I think I think I was able to, you know, save a lot of juice to, to my surprise. So, you know, that's where the EV really does the best is going slow. <laughs> so uh, we were certainly efficient. <laughs> I'll give it that. Yeah. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and figure out where I'm going here and I'll check in in about seven hours, whatever it is. All right, peace out. All right, super quick update video. Huge thanks to Vion. I was setting up here, it's super hot, super sunny where I'm at right now. As you can see, the sun is out. I decided to put up all my privacy curtains or at least most of them while I was parked and it really kept the heat down. But I happen to notice right here, you will see that wet spot right there. And we just had that huge rain from the, uh, the hurricane. And uh, it would appear that my roof still leaks 
So I'm really glad I didn't get this retinted again. And uh, looks like I probably need a new roof. So I'm gonna be taking this in for service soon. And uh, I will keep you all posted. Um, I know like a lot of people, well, good camera work. I know a lot of people have been, uh, a lot of my friends have especially have teased me about my uh, exceptional roof in this car. And I deserve that, so thank you. And I guess I'm gonna be teased a little bit more now that I've discovered this. But uh, this time I'm gonna take it to Tesla and Camarillo. And hopefully they will get it right once and for all so that way I don't have to deal with this garbage anymore. Anyway, there you have it. Don't forget to subscribe, comment down below. Um, have you had this happen? Um, I guess it was common, I don't know. I'm really sick of these leaks, that's for sure. So hopefully I can get that taken care of and uh, get back on the road with no issue. So, well, I don't always tell you, but when I do, I tell you what. Here we are, friends, heading back from Carl's Bath. I actually stopped at Carl's Jr. because <laughs> I was hungry and it was open. Uh, <clears throat> I think it was San Clemente. And uh, yeah, it hit the spot. Got me going. Um, I've learned sometimes, like on these drives, like I get really sleepy because it's been a long time since I had a meal. So, I just, you know, I've, I've decided it's better to be uh, not hungry. And I uh, got myself a little superstar burger there. You know, no combo. I don't need fries and a drink. But uh, it was good. So, uh, in any case, just a little update uh, on the old drive here. We are looking at... Uh, what are we looking at? Yeah, 12.32 a.m., get home. Excellent. 55 minutes, 58 miles, loving that as well. Um, estimated home with 14% state of charge, which, you know, is not a huge buffer, but it, it's enough. Uh, we're at 37% now, 125 miles estimated range. Pretty good, man. Pretty good. Um, just hoping for like an uneventful trip back. The, uh, you know, I usually don't talk about work, but you know, work was good. Um, you know, we were playing a wedding and it was like a top forties kind of band and uh, really slamming band tonight. Like it was great. Um, trombone player and sax player were great so you know that made my life nice I was very happy with that um, and the rest of the band was killing too so uh, really good time there we had some good food at the break that was great and uh, <clears throat> lots of speeches for the wedding party so that made our break longer that was good uh, but man long day three and a half hours to get down there um, you know I guess an hour hour and 40 minutes to get home so uh, you know five hours of driving <clears throat> we played 5.30 to 10.30 and then we rehearsed you know 3.30 to 4.30 so drove for five hours played for six hours <laughs> I'm, I'm tired and I have to get up at four so <laughs> it's gonna be it's gonna be like I said a very exciting 24 hours um, but yeah I wanted to give a huge shout out to my uh, um, my cousin Ashley uh, and her husband Kevin they just took delivery of a new model 3 and uh, they used my referral code BAM so they got a discount on their car and I got 10,000 points so this car is about to get the acceleration boost. <laughs> uh, I can't wait 
my son is going to be so happy. So, I mentioned that just because, link in the description, Tesla referral. I know most of you watching this probably already have a Tesla, but, you know, what the heck. I got You can't blame a guy for trying, right? So, uh, if you're looking for one, use my code. Uh, um, maybe just go test drive one. Use my link. I'll still get like 100 points. And, uh, you know, it's good for you. It's good for me. It's good for everybody. Um, also, shameless plug. Uh, I probably talked about Vion earlier, but if I didn't, I love Vion. Please check my referral link on them. Uh, it's a really great company. Um, they've been just so good to me. And uh, their products are just fabulous. So, I, you know, I would tell you, even if, you know, even if I just bought them and tried them, I would love these products. They're great. The roof shade is a slamming deal. I think it's like 50, you get a discount. It's like under 60 bucks for the roof shades. Super awesome. Also the blackout shades, super awesome. Um, those are kind of like my favorite things. Also the HEPA filter, really, really fantastic. Um, and I've, I've got videos coming uh, they sent me the dash mat and the phone mount, so I need to need to unbox those and do do a couple videos. I'm really excited about that. Um, uh, they've just been so great about sending me all their new products, and uh, really, really big fan. So do check out Vion. Um, you know, and and also it has to be said, I'm still really loving my base nor floor mats. Um, really, really good mats. So I've got a link in the description for those as well. Um, <clears throat> I've got like the full kit, you know, front seats, rear seats, frunk, trunk, and sub trunk. Really, really great. All weather. They've saved my butt several times. Uh, I spilled an entire glass of water on the passenger side and, you know, no casualties. It all went in the floor mat and I just dumped it out. And, uh, also on our Vegas trip spilled milk <laughs> in the driver's or uh, passenger side uh, floor mat and forgot to wipe it up and it dried and all I did was just literally hose the mat off so they're really really great helps keep your car clean um, I'm not trying to plug these things just to be annoying I really like these products so that's why I'm saying it um, and and use my links get your discounts you'll help support my channel and you'll get some good stuff for your car. So just trying to like, trying to help y'all out here. That's all. Um, yeah, I'm in Tustin. This is pretty much where, <laughs> this is pretty much where I need to be at 6.30 tomorrow morning. Awesome. I'm going to pass my work. <laughs> I considered even like sleeping in the car, but eh, that's a little, I think, three hours of sleep at home in my bed is probably better than six hours in my car. Um, yeah, I, I wouldn't even get six hours. So anyway, I think, uh, I think that does it for my little update here. Uh, <clears throat> are we talking? Yeah. So I've done 189 miles since charge gone through 44 kilowatt hours and uh, 233 watt hours per mile efficiency so really really quite good look at that we passed 41,000 miles pretty sweet um, yeah I, I, I made a short video today I I discovered um, a slight uh, leak in my roof you can't see it now but uh, yeah, I think I'm going to have to get this roof replaced for the second time. Um, yes, very amusing. <laughs> but, uh, I get, you know, as long as Tesla pays for it, I'm fine. Uh, all right, so that's about that. I'll uh, check in when I get home, and we'll just talk final numbers. All right, made it back, finally. And we'll check it out, the Carl's Bad Trip. 238 miles and we've got 14% remaining estimated 47 miles so yeah so there you have it I guess 241 total since we left 
241 plus 247. So that's uh, two, uh, oh God, <laughs> 288. Is that right? Am I going crazy? 41 and 47. For, uh, 88, yeah. So yeah, 288 miles, not 200 and, or 338. But uh, still, pretty good range uh, out of the 100% charge there. Um, yeah. Well, it's been a fun trip, kind of. <laughs> Thank you for coming along with me for the ride. It's nice to have company. Um, if you have any questions, drop them down below. Don't forget to check the links in the description. Um, you know, for discounts and good stuff. Um, yeah, so videos coming soon, acceleration boost, um, some more Vion stuff. It's going to be great. Um, that's about it. Until next time, my friends, stay driven. Bye. Perfect.